Hello, fat fans. Welcome to BBC World. Deontay Wilder has stated that if Brazil dies in the ring, that he will have no sympathy for the guy or his family due to what happened, you know, in that hotel lobby in Birmingham, Alabama. Remember when、um, Brazil fought Isogono after he defeated the guy? You know we all knew what happened. Marcelo's water, the brother of the underwater. You know, and Brazil had some bitter confrontation. You know, so water saying that if Brazil doesn't ring, he will have no sympathy. Saying that if it happens, it happens. I mean, he don't give a fuck about it, you know. And I have to actually comment on that statement coming from Ward. I mean, Ward shouldn't be a guy, you know, that not not expect that wants some certain things to happen just because he don't like someone. And as a professional boxer, I think Wilder should be disciplined for that statement, saying that he wouldn't mind if Brazil dies in the ring because all those guys, you know, they go to the ring and they lay their lives on the line just for our entertainment. You know, boxing is not a joke. I mean, what will the WBC President Marcelo Lima do well. I think nothing because those guys are nothing but protectors of the Ontario Water. We all know that. I mean, Water said this before that he would like to kill someone in the ring. I mean, that would be very badass and other stuff. And what the the WBC、uh, President Suleiman did? What did he do? Nothing. He did nothing. All he did was, you know, actually nothing, bro. And it just kind of sad because the boxing politics, you know, favoritism has become a cancer, you know, to the sweet science that we all love. And water for saying that is a disgrace, and that's the reason why. He does not, <clears throat> and we not become a used star or role model like Joshua is. <clears throat> no way. You know, and he complain about people not liking him. You know, people are watching, especially kids are watching. You know, people see water as nothing but a loud mouth idiot who has no. Self control, who is too emotional, and who sometimes talk like a little child. Why would you expect a wife to lose a husband? You know, it's just kind of crazy. But that's just who what I is. I mean, he's this guy that want to be a badass and a gangster so bad. But reality says water is not a gangster. I mean, has never been. It's just trying to act like he's one. We all know he isn't. Um. So water, you know, don't have any sympathy and feelings. This guy has no, no soul. So what I said, well, because this is boxing, this is what we do, this is what we sign up for. You talk about me killing the guy. If it happens, it happens. When you are dealing with a situation like this and it's personal, I don't mean well for him, nor do he mean well for me. So I speak the truth. That's why people love me to this day. 
because I speak facts. I speak truth. I'm going to handle my business in the ring accordingly. I promise you that I'm not taking Brazil easy. I'm taking him as if he were a champion. He's going to be the guinea pig in this experiment. I don't like him at all. What he does, what he's done, is unacceptable, and I can't wait for this fight. Water is actually heartless, in my opinion, and the WBC should be very ashamed of themselves. You know, all those corrupt old men should be ashamed for allowing him to get, you know, to get a pass for such statements. Is, in my opinion, not fair, because if Anthony Joshua do something similar. Or say something similar to this. We all know the outcry from the fans around the globe. Say, "Oh, I thought he was a smart guy. Oh, I thought he was this general guy. <clears throat> no, all those guys now they're quiet. You know, I mean, they are heartless, and this is this is very sad to see. I mean, why would you want a man with family and keys to take care of to lose his life just because you don't like him?" I don't want to bring race into this. I don't want to bring troubles into this. But I just want to say, John Tawala is not a human being. You know, he's not a human being with a heart because you've got a daughter, you've got kids as well. What hap? What will happen if this statement? You know. I don't. I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. I don't want people to come here and start saying rubbish. I'm just going to say that Deontay Water is heartless. He should apologize for such stupid and irresponsible words. You know. I mean, he should apologize because if you don't like someone, you don't have to wish them death. You know, because especially. A man with with a family, a wife, lovely kids. Don't like the guy, fine. But why wish him dead? Because it just it's just it's just kind of crazy, guys. Anyway, uh, give your thoughts below, like the video, share, and please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, guys. And uh, go follow me on Instagram at Box and Block Center, and as well on Twitter at Box and Block. Cheers, everyone.